<laughs> Sorry. They don't want to hear another joke from me. Okay, all the way from Minneapolis, so I can find an open mic to do this throwback piece for my husband's birthday. Right. Who is 29 today, Matthew James. Woohoo! I wrote this piece for him six years ago, and I don't think I've ever performed it since. Wow. So, Maybe some weekend we can grab coffee. So I said, yeah. But the feeling wasn't cheap, not overrated or imitated, just sweet. So now 2,192 days later, though we've crossed a few bridges faster than intended, you always clarify intention and you patiently listen. Well, I read mark up our paper and I circle every error and I always jump to conclusions before I ever hear your thesis. Was the piece them in the clutter. I give you reason after reason, but you do not receive it, and now, baby, we are better. I'm so thankful for you. Because you never make things too deep. You're always willing to tread water and let me dangle my feet. You are good to me. Because I know you had to get tired, but you always deem me worthy, and in that, you remind me of my father. You are good to me. I'm thankful for you and how you love me in your servitude. Not subservient, but sacrificial, like David with his men, a loyal heart, a strong spirit. You act on your conviction. I couldn't have drawn you up if I had an outline. I couldn't have caught you if I cast it all day from sunup till sundown. So I know it's your birthday, but you are my gift. And whether forever or for a season, I'd be damned if I didn't tell you this. I had no idea that. You'd be so perfectly a piece of work. I stand in awe, my sweet surprise, my sweet, sweet. 